that? That's the sound of a student-built race car, which set a land speed record in its division just last week. The dragster, known as the Aggie A Salt Streamliner, clocked in at 64.4 miles per hour while driving across the Bonneville salt flats. At first, you might not think that's very fast, but there's a twist. This dragster is being powered by fuel made from cheese waste. We're the first school to actually run biofuels uh, in order to set the record. Uh, so that's, that's, a big, that's a big jump. That's a big push for Utah State University, so we can be really proud of that. The dragster was built in just a few months, but scientists have tested these fuels for the last six years. I think that's probably the most impressive part of this whole project, is the fact that we've got students that are uh, coming across multiple colleges from agriculture, uh, from engineering, from the sciences, and that they're all working as a team. Although these alternative fuels are now just powering this small engine dragster, this fuel made from cheese waste may be powering your own car in the future. And for research assistant Michael R. Morgan, who also took the wheel of the race car, he hopes that the progress made might steer everyone in the direction toward more successful research. I think it jumps us to the front because now it, it puts a target for everybody else to shoot at because there are schools and companies all over the U.S. and throughout the world that are working on these same types of projects and we went out and we did it. And so for those that haven't done it or those that are close, hopefully it spurs them on and gets the research moving forward because that opens up opportunities for students here and students everywhere else. Kelsey Keller, ATV News.